You guys have a big lead early, you give it away almost, and get out of a, a big bases loaded jam, boys to say hi, you know, getting a big strike out there, and you guys able to get a, a one run win. Well, I mean, it's a big win. I mean, you know, when we're, we're in the position that we're in right now, uh, one game under 500, and, you know, in the position we are in conference, uh, Long Beach is a good team. Uh, they're, they're a hot team, um, good RPI, and, you know, we needed to get that win. So, uh, some guys stepped up, and, and uh, fortunately, we were able to uh, hold on. With the way your, your pitching has struggled during the midweek, you know you're going to need some runs. How yeah. important was it to you know get some early to get you guys going? Oh, it was important. I mean, you know, I mean, I don't, you don't expect to get eight runs in the first inning. I mean, that was very unusual. I mean, you know, we, we had some breaks, we had some good at bats, we had a couple walks, and and then one thing led to another, really, and and uh, so we never would expect to have that many, but it was nice to have that many. And we have a freshman on the mound, and you know he comes out and walks a guy, and and then thing, one thing leads to another. But he did pitch out of problems with the base loader as well, with one out. So there were some bright spots, but Hadley was a bright spot. Uh, Gatsby, I thought, did a good job uh, getting a, getting a strikeout, and then of course you know Moises really is. Has really stepped up for us. Yeah, tell me a little bit about him. Uh, showing a lot of confidence you know, with one, you know, one hit, and, and yeah. you suddenly go to him for a six-out save, uh, and you know, put the ball on his court, basically. Well, you know, it's a road road game, and, and you know, you just don't want to leave your closer, you know, in in the bullpen. And he's been really good um, all season. Uh, he was kind of in a setup role. We weren't getting to where we wanted to get to. Brian obviously struggled in, as a closer, as a young closer. Uh, I think he's still capable of being that guy, but Moises has taken over that thing, and it kind of started against Oregon. Really, no words were said. It was to say, hey, here's the ball, it's the ninth inning, and, and he just seemed like he's kind of a, you know embraced that role. And you know you could tell he's got some demeanor and some, some presence, presence and, and uh, some confidence. So you know, good for him. And he's usually pretty straight-faced on the mound. I saw him, he gave a little smirk when he, when he got that strikeout, though. Yeah, I don't know. I didn't. I didn't see it. I mean, I just know that uh, it was a long night. There was a ton of pitches, and you know, we were fortunate to come out of here with a win. When you're playing such a, a long game, um, how do you make make sure the guys are staying focused, especially you know as they start chipping away and, well, and coming back? At like you. I told them, you know, it's, it's. I mean, this time of the year, May and June, I mean, that's the best time to play college baseball. And, and really, you know, regardless of how it comes out, sometimes uh, this what game was clearly. A marathon and um, you know we held on but you know it's, it, it, it's it's so important and it was a big game for Long Beach as well I mean I think yeah, I told them everybody's in the same boat I mean the other you know the other people are in a little better position uh, Long Beach is in a better position than we are certainly 10 games above 500 but uh, you know if you don't play well I don't care who you are the last three or four weeks of the season you could be in trouble uh, when it comes you know selection time and and we're playing every game. I mean, the position that we're in, uh, it's important to get as many wins as we can. And you guys sitting at 500 now, how do you feel about the team going forward? What's kind of the key for you guys to potentially go on a run? Well, I think to swing the bats, really. I mean, I think, you know, we swung the bats well Sunday at, at Utah and in you know, a must win. I mean, we come home 9-12, and 12, you're, you're in big trouble. And now, you know, we came back 10-11. and 11. Um, We didn't, you know, do what we needed to do up there, but we did salvage it and, uh, I would say offense, and then, you know, our, our bullpen has been better, uh, certainly on the weekends, and uh, Hadley and, and Mo, you know, we'd like to get Forbes going. Uh, that would be a nice added piece that uh, would be, uh, you know, very helpful. So uh, we got we got, we got got guys, uh, certainly, that would, are capable of doing it, And uh, but it's good to see the bats going and, and being a little offensive, and, um, you know, Peterson's going a little bit now, and, and Falia's gone, you know, for mo most of the year, and and Bouchard and you know so we're, we got guys that are capable and then some guys are swinging back pretty good right now.